What's up, guys? Hang out with the fourth, 14 year YouTuber, and welcome to a review of FKU or Franco Kernel Updater. Now, this app is really, really useful if you have a rooted device and a Nexus device. If you don't have a Nexus rooted device, this app is basically just not even going to be worth mentioning. But if you do have a rooted Nexus device, then you're in luck because you can get Franco Kernel updater and you can get a the franco kernel which is one of the best kernels in my opinion the best kernel custom kernel out to date so let's go ahead and hop into fku or franco kernel updater now here here's the interface and it's really really simple the tabs on the left show you what they do kernel settings you can change stuff like the iao scheduler which i have no idea what it is uh cpu manager you can overclock underclock file manager they do have a specific file manager in here so that's pretty cool um, color control, you can change the colors, but it's not functional on my device. Uh, per app modes, you can actually set the device to overclock on certain games. So, example, uh, if you have, for me, MC4 is a heavy game. Um, Temple Run, not Temple Run 2, what am I talking about? Real Racing 3 is a heavy game, maybe. If you have a device that's really not that fast, and you want it to be faster on those games, set a per app mode. Uh, say you have a Nexus 4, for example, which is, uh, I think it's compatible. Uh, set it to overclock on FIFA. I have mine set to overclock on FIFA. Um, I don't have it on MC4 because it kept crashing, but um, real boxing. And that's pretty much it. I should take those off because I, I don't even have Franco Kernel installed right now. I have the standard Omni-ROM one. But I do use Franco Kernel sometimes, uh, more times than others. Um, app system monitor, you can actually monitor your, uh, CPU cores, which ones are offline, which ones are online. Right now, I'm not doing anything. All I'm doing is talking and going through an app. So the CPU cards aren't working hard. You see 19%, 47%. They're not working hard at all. So now when I get in the game, all four of those cores are pumping hard. Uh, pause. All right. Um, in the, let's see what else is there. Backup and restore. You can actually back up your boot image, which is basically the kernel. And um, that's pretty much it. In the connected part, they show you news about the betas, stuff like that. Um, but they don't really keep that updated, so I wouldn't really check on that. But that's pretty much it. Franco Kernel Updater is the app to get if you have a Nexus device that's rooted and you are looking for a custom kernel. I'll have an APK in the description because this app does cost, I think, $1.99 or a dollar or something like that. So I'll have the APK link in the description. And this is only for Android, of course, because you can't get custom kernels on an iPhone or an iPad or iPod or anything, but um, thank you guys for watching. Here I was for a fortune YouTuber. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, comment down below if you have any questions about this or any questions to me because I will answer them. Trust me, I will find you and answer the questions, and because that's what I do. And I'm Henry Robert Fourth, and I'm out. Peace. Have fun with Franco Kernel if you did get it. So I'm out. Peace.